My name is Enrique. My name is Eli. And my name is Tristan. Time to talk about Senku and the boys. They're back. Yes, sir. Stone, season three. Uh, have they, did they have, say, a subtitle for this? Is it New World? New World, or, yeah. Yeah, yep. Cool. Yeah, Dr. Stone, New World, season three. One through five, because we, we said we're going to jump into it a little late. So we just covered everything they had for now. Was it five or four? Five. It was five, and okay, I feel like was this five. was a perfect point for us to cover. It really, really was, because they're about to go do some shit. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, one sentence. One sentence review for this. I, really, it's the prologue for the season, to be honest for you. But, yeah, that's uh, pretty true. I'll come first with this shit. You doing okay? what? You're stupid. I like Ryusui. Period. I agree. Okay. Uh, I got. I legit forgot how much I enjoyed this show. Dang, it's only been a couple months, buddy. Um, one sentence review. They are really. Uh, I'm really okay with them picking up the pace, like the small time skips that they continue to do. I'm I'm okay with that in in this show more than anything else. So. Last time we saw Reusable, you guys weren't down with him yet. You guys down nah, with him now? I am definitely down with him. Eh. Okay. He's. I think he's really cool. You know, he's getting there. For you know, like he's uh, getting there. I like him more. Uh, objectively, I appreciate him. Uh, I don't care for him as much, but I don't hate him uh, as much as I did at the start. See. I, I feel like I, I maybe it is similar. I don't know. It's been a minute, but I feel like they totally like upside down flip flopped his character around to where he's not you know greedy for himself. You know, like to, to, they totally changed that motto of you know greed equals what justice or whatever it was. Like, so I I don't know. Like I feel like what the episode we watched a while back, like he was in it for himself, and now I feel like he's in it for the team, and I feel like. They definitely changed it up a little bit. He's greedy, but I don't think the episode we watched gave him enough time to understand his full ideology. Yeah, that's true. To really unlock it. I still think he gets annoying sometimes with that greed shit. Mm-hmm. But uh, I, I really see he's fun. And what he, when he really excels is when you start seeing him do his mastercraft. When he starts doing ship stuff and sailing and navigating. He gets real fun to watch at that point, in my opinion. Because he gets real locked in. That stuff is pretty yeah. cool. I do agree. So kick it off. We they are trying to make a boat. Yeah, still trying to make the boat. I mean, it's not easy to make a boat, man. It's yeah, really no, that should take a minute. Yeah, but recently he had some shit talk about God. I forgot. I think he said something along the line. I don't give a damn about God or something like that. At this episode, I feel you, Reusui. Uh The my Minecraft parody in the first episode was pretty fucking <laughs> that funny. Was that wild. was wild. I was like, no, no, where did they I, get the licensing? They didn't. They, they just did. Yeah, there's no way they did. They just said, because fuck it. Uh, the manga used to do that a lot with video games and stuff like that. They make a lot of referential stuff. I, to I thought it was sweet, days. dude. It did. it was pretty fucking cool. <laughs> it was like they were turning the blocks and stuff. It was fucking, it was awesome. It's like, bro, this is what I do in Minecraft. <laughs> I felt I've resonated with that, you know. The uh, the I wish first Minecraft episode would give us a map like that. Yeah, that's pretty true. The first episode, uh, Taiju turns into the fucking wheat master. Oh uh, yeah, he's he's growing wheat. That was fire. Weed too, but that's on the side. <laughs> Shit. It was that cool. I got that real sticky, <laughs> <laughs> bro. That's it's wild, wild bro. They would be rolling shit up crazy out there. <laughs> You'd have to be right. That would have been killer, bro. I'm like, oh man, that'd be fucking hilarious. Them in the cave, like cavemen just smoking on good fucking. <laughs> Dude, you know Chrome smoking that loud, bro. <laughs> Chrome is going. That's why Chrome is so experimental. Like, yeah, he just, yep. he's just getting high. He's like, yo, what if I? What if I take this rock <laughs> and, I, and I hit it with this rock? <laughs> uh, it's like crumbs and motherfucking G. <laughs> Bro. You know, honestly, they couldn't have weed around because one particular person would be smoking all their shit. And it's fucking Kizaki, bro. bro. He Kiseki, would jump. That's my guy. Kiseki, bro, he'd jump out the Range Rover, bro. 
in the suit. Bro, bro, that was, that was so <laughs> much drip. Dude, he was. Dude, he's. Oh my god, bro. The OG. That was awesome. I lost it when he dropped the, Same, the bro. suit, bro. Oh. He still has it because you remember he had it in the last in the the end episode of the last season, the bonus episode. But well, I had forgotten yeah, about it. He he don't have it anymore because as soon as they well, told yeah, him what he that's built, that's why I said he had. It. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, bro, he, sh- he shed that here. bitch. They, he started. Sinky started whispering in his ear, and he was like, "Oh." <laughs> <laughs> I love that gag so much. It's so yeah. good dude. of him just going swole mode. <laughs> it's it's like Roshi when Roshi did the buff up. Remember? Oh my the, gosh! The, yeah, the comment. Yeah, it's the same shit. So it's a good time. I I, I love. Oh God, this has such a fun cast of characters, dude. Agreed. I agree. It's probably like one of my favorite shows as far as characters go. Well, okay. Here's the other thing, though. I feel like. Some of the characters did not get. I feel like because we've added so many characters at this point, even when not all of them are as important, I feel like we're not getting as much um, interpersonal stuff. I don't know about that. If that's the right word. But relationships. Yeah, like I don't feel like we're getting as much of the important characters right now, and just seeing yeah. their personal sides. Uh, the only it, it's very plot driven at the moment and much less character driven, which the only, is good, but still, I, I don't know, man. Like the only character I agree with you full heartedly on is probably Kohaku, um, because she really didn't get much screen time in these first five. Because really Senku, didn't. we get, I feel like we got a decent amount of Chrome. I I do agree that he's probably not there as much, but I felt like we got him a decent amount. And then he after okay that, we did at least get a spotlight moment. And then after that, I don't really find a lot of them as main characters. I mean, Taiju got more time in this than he did in any of the other seasons just because he's back now. Yeah. Granted, uh, they just turned him into super duper meathead. He's always been. I mean, he's always been. Him. A, yeah, I was going to yeah, say. Yeah, but not, not uh, like, yes. all he, okay, no, no, hold on, hold on. All he was used for in this season was a quick bit of let me do this super ridiculous athletic thing. And that was the only thing. That's he did. what he does. He's muscle team. Yeah, I know that, but that's all he did. Like he didn't even really have any other lines. What do you want him to say? He's not smart. He's not really <laughs> funny unless he's saying something stupid. Yeah. So what do you want from him to say? Want him to come out and be like, "Well, Senku, if you actually t- carry the two over on that equation, we can make the ship a much." Quicker. I don't know, man, but he's Senku's <laughs> best friend. You would think they would talk more. Well, you see, Senku, I'm growing this sticky icky. <laughs> this is like the third time that they like they. <laughs> They've been a separator for like three years throughout the entire run of the show. What do you want from them? Do you just want them to hang out and be buddies? Go to the bar the village? Yeah, bro. Of course. That's what I want. I want more characterization right now, even though the plot is thickening. Well, I do too, but, you know, it's tough shit. That's not, who's Somebody got to turn off what? their fucking phone, Bozo Tristan. That's the third time. Bro. I That's... don't believe it. <laughs> Whoa, I don't know that Imagine <laughs> having the volume on your phone on. What? Okay, so that happens. They're building boat. Okay. Nikki. No, not Nikki. Nikki. The reporter? Anyone know the reporter's name? I don't know uh, the reporter's jur- name. Journalass. That's racist. No, that's that's, Bro, her that's nickname. what they said. That's not her name. I don't no, that, care that, if it's not her name. That's what they said. But she's cool, you know. They talked about her and getting her a little picture camera. Senku got the cold ass picture repeating Einstein's pose and shit. That was pretty. That was dope. Pretty fire. I like them taking the pictures of uh, from from the air in the hot air balloon. That's pretty solid too. Doing the work there. Hey, look! I mean, Kohaka did something right there. She saw the oil, bro. That is true. The return of Suika was also fire. That little Suika, I love Suika. Suika's awesome. She's hilarious. She's cool. Detective mode, fantastic. Tweak is great. She's a great little comedy bit. Better than Nezuko, hashtag ratio. That's facts. Uh, well, she she has a companion who's better than Nezuko, too. The, <laughs> the boar. The dog? Oh. The boar, bro. The boar? I thought you meant the little dog. Shock. <laughs> oh, the dog, too. The dog is Nezuko, bro. Yeah, they're trying to eat that. France. Oh, Francois here. I think Francois that's why cool. we missed some characters is because we had to introduce yes. and more of Rui and Francois. Yeah. I agree. Francois, Francois is dope, bro. Sick, dude. I That's could use a Francois a on a, a abandoned island. 
<laughs> do you, so, did you guys watch the first couple subbed or dubbed? I watched, I watched everything all subbed. Subbed. Okay, I watched some subbed, or I watched some the first couple dubs, and I switched to sub. Um, in the sub, did they just use they them pronouns for Francois? Yes. Originally, yeah. Okay, because in the dub they did, and I believe in the manga, I have to go back and read it because it's been a couple of years at this point. But I think when they referred to Francois, different characters would use different pronouns. Oh, weird. So it's like that's more of like the lean on to the gag of like they don't know what the fuck Francois is. Well, I mean, yeah, it doesn't and like Ryusui it just it doesn't did. matter because Ryusui's like I don't fucking know. Like, <laughs> yeah, it does, doesn't just, matter. Like, Francois is the most skilled person. That's all that that's, matters. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's that was the interesting part part about it. It was just like just like okay, I always kind of read into it that Francois was a chick, but I mean, that's, it's up for that's what I'm leaning. Towards. That's what I took it as. But it's more up for interpretation than anything, especially when I read it because you didn't have a voice. You know what right. I'm saying? So, like, it really was, what do you think? And there's been plenty of animes where we've seen very feminine male characters. Mm-hmm. So, it's up for interpretation. I'm So, if I say she, he, or them, just know I'm not being mean. I just remember that as she because that's how I read it. <laughs> okay? Yeah. Thank you. Thank Francois you. is a I very mean, ambiguous character right now. I mean, exactly. Speaking of feminine male characters, I still have to stop myself from thinking Karapika is a chick sometimes. That's true too, man. Like I really do think Kirby is a, a chick, I, but then I'm like, no, that's don't disrespect Kirby. Well, that's not disrespecting. Call, I guess calling someone they're, something they're not is disrespect. So mm-hmm. I don't mean to disrespect Kirby because he's one of the coldest motherfuckers out. Like, period. <laughs> what do you go red eyes? You already know bodies are dropping. <laughs> uh, Francois Sweet, they I almost said she. I don't know. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> she made a bunch of fucking food and stuff. For everyone. Bro, the stolen? Oh, that made me excited when they it, said they that, was that doing stolen. Look, it looked good. Have you eaten that before? Yes, we make it every year. Oh, oh, really? Man. I've it never had delicious, that. delicious, bro. That's some cultured people shit. I don't, you know. Yeah, that's I don't... like, guys, like, make, I take some masa and I make some tortillas. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro, I'll, I'll send a loaf to each of you this, this coming season. Shit, yes, I can keep please. that shit around for three years, they say. Yeah. <laughs> I don't guarantee anything about what we make over here. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Damn. We're, we're, but I like Francois. Francois they're is fun. Sweet. They're a fun little uh, companion to Reese. Bro, I love how... And then Chrome mentioned it, of course, but just... <laughs> Francois is prepared for everything. Oh, I thought this might happen, so I did this. What? What? Do you, how did you possibly think that we would need a, a timer for the camera? Good on it's you. It's the perfect oh. out, bro. It's the perfect out for their writing. It's awesome. Yeah, it's just like, oh, Francois's ready, baby. <laughs> Francois is the uh, the Swiss Army knife of the crew. Very um, necessary. How did you guys feel about the end of episode three? Dude, I was, was kind of freaked out, to be honest. Like, okay, I was like, dude, this was like one of the sickest moments, in my opinion. It like actually felt like it turned into like a horror show for a minute. I agree. Because at first I was like, oh, that sounds like Morse code. Uh, and then they were like, oh, we're just, they're just, you know, interrupting this. And they were like, oh, wait, that is Morse code. And they said, why? I was like, why? What do you mean, why? What are we talking about why for? That was creepy as all could be. And it was just no, it was, it was so sweet, dude. That why? was, in these five episodes, that was probably my favorite moment by far. Like That was a very I, good moment. I, I hope they do more of that stuff because that was dude, so cool. Let me tell you something. Back when I was reading this, so I started reading the, the Dr. Stone manga middle of Stone Wars is where I caught up to, right? So from Stone Wars to the end of the series, I was reading it week to week, right? Okay. When imagine going well, you guys don't have to imagine. So you guys went from Stone Wars to all of a sudden there's a fucking someone tapping into their radio signal saying why. I was shook. I was like, what the fuck <laughs> yeah. is going? What? And then in the in the did they do I kind of forgot because my brain's jumbled with the five episodes and the other shit we watched this week. Did they do the big skull thing? Yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh big yeah. Skull thing. When they start they personified the Y as a big like skull oh, saying it. Yeah. No, that was creepy. Ooh. That thing is I don't like that thing. So cool, man. It's I, so <laughs> cool. It was so fucking this is my we're going into my favorite part of the entire series right now. And I see really why now. Yeah. But it's woo I love Doctor Stone. <laughs> Oh, I'm so glad you guys like this nearly as much as I do. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. 
And then for the next two, we were doing more shipbuilding stuff. It was yeah. pretty much all oil finding, shipbuilding, mining. Radar, sonar. Mining. Radars, yeah. Bonar. I will say... Sorry, go. No, I was going to move on. What were you saying, Eli? Uh, well, I was going to move on to like the end end, so... That's where I was heading to. Okay. I will Let's say, do I don't mean to jump too far ahead. Uh, who the fuck are they leaving behind, bro? This That's exactly like, what I was going to. Like, is that they brought the entire main crew. That's what I'm saying, bro. They're like, oh, yeah, you guys are going to come. You guys are going to stay here and industrialize. I'm like, bro, you really left the fucking C squad here to build some apartments? Like, I don't know what their thinking is. Um, cause, Could they leave Kaseki behind or no? No, they took Kaseki. Did they? Fuck. Yes. I think they did. I, they, they I did. promise you they did. Yeah, uh, they really did take all the A-Squad people. <laughs> they, The most important character, at least that we've seen as far as screen time goes, that got left behind is uh, Kizuki, or not, Kohaku's sister. Yeah, Ruri. What about the yeah, journalist? Her, lady her lady and lady the journalist. Behind. The journalist comes second. But it what's she going like, to do with them? Take pictures? <laughs> yeah. It would have been, uh, what is it, Kinro? Kinro's the bitch one, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. it would have been him, but you know his plan kind of failed. Taiji fucking ran and said, "Come here!" He's like, "No!" <laughs> <laughs> God, his ass. How do you feel about them bringing the prisoners with the A squad? It's hey, it's smart, it makes bro. Makes a and lot the, of sense to me. And that thing is, bro, I fuck with the prisoners too. I'm hoping they turn into good guys someday. Because there's, it's two, right? It's yeah. um I forgot their names, bro. Oh, uh, the Kyoga. Kyoga, yeah. Kyoga, yeah. And someone. and the chick. Yeah. The pink hair chick, right? They're the prisoners? Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes. It was those two. And I, Hyoga's so cool, bro. But oh, he's unfortunately, he's also a bad guy. So He is a bad guy. But he be, do be cold as fuck, though. <laughs> oh, man. So they're, they're, they say set sail, you know. Second series we've watched about setting sail in the last few weeks. <laughs> but yes, are curious where they're going, what they're doing at this point. Uh, not, uh, I mean, don't we kind of know where they're supposed to be going right now? I was right going to say they're going to Treasure I Island, bro. Treasure Island. They're going to yes. South America. Yes. Are they going to South? Or are they just going to Treasure Island? They're going to Treasure Island right now. Yeah, South going, America isn't in... Or Treasure Island isn't in South America. No, it's just... It's right off, like, the coast or whatever of where yeah. the crash site was. Because it can't be too oh. far, because obviously Senku's great alive. great grandpappy would have had to, you know, go that's over right. to Ishigami Village or whatever. Yeah, because that's all his descendants. Yeah. And then we get, you know, they got away with Senku being able to fuck them because they're not blood, so, you know. That's how him and the clock can happen still. Just don't think about it. No, they're not blood. That's, that's what I'm saying. I know. I know. So he can still, you know, he can still bang out Kohaku low key. I love their relationship, but I wish they would show it more. <sighs> that's fair yeah so that that's kind of where we left off is that that was like I said perfect stopping point or perfect jumping in point for us the prologue was the entire preamble to Treasure Island and now we're going there and yeah boy yeah boy this is my favorite arc right here <laughs> I, I'm, I'm just so glad this show's back bro like as far as like enjoyment goes this is one of my most this is one of my like favorite shows just based off enjoyment alone Top shows list about to get fucked up by Dr. Stone again. Sucker. Dr. Stone's like, okay, I didn't make top three last year. Now, oh no, I did. It was two, right? Pretty sure it yeah. was up there. It would have had Lost to up the summertime, right? Yeah. Oh, that's right. Summertime. Dr. Stone's about to come in and try to knock people out and get one this time. If it's allowed to. It, it's a new season. Yes, of course it is. That's a good point. The only thing, time to get disqualified for that is characters. It never shows. How's but that Ryusui fair to disqualify a show because we like season two? <laughs> Are you telling Ryusui me that Supernatural shouldn't character. have been on the should have been on the best shows list for year it two? It should have been. You're right. Yep. But no, it shouldn't have been. Because <laughs> we take all of what we watched that year, remember, into one. Sounds like it should have been on the top shows list in year two. No. Did you not watch season fifteen? That wasn't year two, in year two. Tra- Tra- you two would have been, let's, because we watched the first three oh, year one. True, yeah. Yeah, year bro, two would have been four, five, four five, six, five. seven, eight. Bro, we had, yeah, easy eight. money. Eight. That's Leviathans. Bro, it's fine. <laughs> Leviathans. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. You're trying to argue <laughs> Leviathans would be in there. 
bro, I'm memeing this whole time. Obviously, okay. Supernatural was never going to make it on the top shows list. I, if it was, I got, if I we got somehow got going. one through five in one year, it could have been. It yeah, been. yeah, I'll, I'll give you that. That's why I thought you were arguing argue that you just, you just forgot the, the, the years. No, 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 See, no, I, I didn't. I was just trying to meme on you a little bit. See, in the first year where we had, like, Avatar, Dark, like, I don't think it, it was touching. Touch it. it was touching. It's not even sniffing top five. <laughs> You don't need the same fucking world, bro. <laughs> no, man. Uh, shout out Dr. Stone. Shout out Senku. Shout out my boy fucking Chrisome. That's my dog for life. <laughs> Chris. That's you know what I mean? You keep low-key <laughs> wearing an old-school do-rag. <laughs> yeah? Yeah? Low-key. You know what I mean? You got the little, you got the little knot, the little rope. You can't wait for him to pull that off and strangle a bitch with it. <laughs> Whoa! Jeez, bro. It's going to be uh, Kohaku's sister, bro. Whoa! Hey, that's his girl, hey, bro. Don't go you whoa. Chill. You that's chill. his remix to ignition. <laughs> Shit! Don't pee stop, on her. Stop! Whoa! Mm, stop! At this point, all the characters have got to be in their twenties, right? You'd think, we're except getting, for uh, we're getting up there. Except for Melonhead. Suika, Suika yeah. I love Suika. Yeah, except for she's works. such a tiny child. Even she's got to be like ten at this point. Or well, because here's the well, thing: because uh, so since the start of the show. It's been like, like three four years, years, right? Like three or four. Four, because it's been a year when they're building the ship. So it's four now. Well, oh gosh, that's right. Just them getting to building the new ship, because they were like, oh, this ship isn't going to be good. We have to build a whole new one. And then they were like, oh, it's going to take a year. And then it happened like in 30 seconds in the show. But they're yeah. like, that's a year. Yeah. And I'm like, oh. Okay. So they're like in their twenties now. Low key, Senku should have got Kahu pregnant by now. But you know, probably like, somebody should have got somebody pregnant by now. Like, <laughs> yeah, that would like, be some teen moms right around the village. There's gotta be, bro. <laughs> <laughs> should have been some sixteen and me somewhere around here. <laughs> Wait a second. That's fucking cr- chromes. I got three baby moms already. <laughs> 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 Real Chrome Dome. <laughs> Yay! You know what I'm saying? Hey, yeah, you know what I'm <laughs> oh, Give God, me I love Chrome this. Dome, baby. <laughs> I love this for your fucking series. <laughs> it's awesome. Uh, any closing remarks, thoughts before we head into, you know, other shit? Uh, oh, no, good. I'm just upset we only get one a week. Yeah. It's going to be good, though. There's going to be a perfect time to go one a week now, but uh, we'll see. So yeah, that was today for for us, I guess, man. It was really fun. Watched some good stuff. Watched, well, yeah, not, everything was good, so life is good. But we got to remind you guys that we got social media, starting off with our Twitter at B-I-N-G-E-B-O-I-S. I really struggled to say that for some reason this week. Hmm, interesting. Change the Y to an I in boys. On Instagram, we have D-A-B-A-N-G-E-B-O-I-S. That's D-A instead of D because we are dumb asses. You'll find pictures and thumbnails of our score so you can see if you want to listen to the episode or skip it because you're angry about what happened. <laughs> you can also find us on TikTok where we post nothing at D-A-B-I-N-G-E-B-O-I-S. That is the same at as Instagram. Change the I or change the Y to an I and D instead of the Thank you guys for hanging out with us today. We want to remind you that with you today, my name was Enrique. My name is Eli. And my name is Tristan. And I want you to remember, I am in a Korean movie the whole time. <laughs>